Warren, you were punching the air on the final whistle. Just explain the emotions. A tough place to come and win. Um, we said at half time that uh, we've been here before. I think mean, 2008, we were behind and we dug deep, we had a good second half, and we just stayed in the match. So, you know, two, two good sides. Uh, we've got a lot of respect for, for England in terms of, you know, definitely the players and management. So, that game could have gone in any way, and we're, we're the ones who are pretty happy. How heroic was that performance from Dan Bigger? They really kept us in the game, didn't they? I mean, two excellent uh, kicking displays by both teams, and we were debating a few minutes to go, did England take the shot at goal? They went for the corner, and you know, could have easily ended up a draw as well, because uh, you know, both, both kickers were excellent. But in uh, the you know, second half, we got a bit more hands on the ball, played in the wider channels, which we talked about at, at half-time. And, and uh, you know, got, on, got on outside them a little bit. So, um, yeah, really pleased with the performance. It's come at a cost, though, some significant injuries this evening. How, how big a concern is that, a rice smile? Yeah, we lost another couple of players today. They looked like Scott Williams. Uh, Helen Mayne was dislocated his shoulder. Uh, they are running out of players in Wales. So. Uh, great, you know, great carry. We put Lloyd Williams on the wing. Great uh, chip inside for um, Gareth Davies and look, they just dug deep. These players have worked so hard and like I said, we've got such a limited uh, pool of players to choose from and uh, I'm absolutely so proud of them. Congratulations. Thank you.